Tonight, we're learning new details about this deadly crash involving two teen boys. One boy is dead, another in critical condition after their car struck a tree near 43rd Avenue and Happy Valley Road early Sunday morning. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Bianca Bono in for Jonathan McCall tonight. 12 News journalist Gabriela Becerra in North Phoenix and shares how family and friends are remembering the teen. A memorial is growing near the scene of a deadly car accident involving two teens, family and friends placing flowers, candles and baseball memorabilia in honor of Riley Young. There aren't enough words to describe 16 year old Riley Young. He was amazing. He was talented. He was kind. He was loving, smart. He just was everything to us. A sophomore at Sandra Day O'Connor High School, Young excelled at everything he did, especially baseball. Winning championships, um, being on all-star teams, travel teams, I mean, you name it. But nothing was more important to the teen than his family. My whole world revolved around him. And his friends. You know, we weren't blood, but our friendship was so strong that he was a brother to us. Dozens of those friends gathered Sunday evening, lighting candles, placing flowers, and sharing memories. He's always the positive. He's always the hype man. He's always keeping it rolling. Phoenix police say young and another teen boy were driving down 43rd Avenue early Sunday morning when the driver lost control of the car and struck a curb. The car rolled before crashing into a tree. The driver is in critical condition. Young died at the hospital. We really had such high hopes and dreams for him. He had dreams. Young was a life lost too soon, but family and friends tell me the impact he made in his 17 years won't be soon forgotten. It was hard. Today was the hardest day of my life, but it was a little better knowing how many people loved him. Everybody who knew him loved him. Friends created a GoFundMe page to help the Young family pay for funeral expenses. If you'd like to donate, we have a link on our website, 12news.com. Reporting in Phoenix, Gabriela Becerra, 12 News.